Hi players, welcome back to the channel. Please remember to click the like, click subscribe and share with all your friends and leave a comment down below, down below. About what? I'm not sure yet, but let's think on that. Today is what's in the mother bag with the play in chief, some call the goat, quite offensive because who wants to be called a goat, but I believe it means something else and I agree with it. Now first thing in the bag, as we can see here, under this beautiful blue head cover, what a player head cover, my sponsor. Yes, I've been sponsored by whataplayergolf.com because they are my official sponsor, sole sponsor of the channel, whataplayergolf.com, get there. And inside this head cover is a Ping G400 LST with a Tour AD VR6 X Flex shaft. It's a little bit softer, not sure why. It's an X-Flex, but not really. This suits me perfectly, but it's a lottery. Next, players, we have a three wood. And my three wood is a Callaway Epic Flash with a Atmos Fujikura 7 Tour X shaft. This is a pure missile maker. If my driver's on the blink, which it often is, I just bring this bad boy out and this thing goes, um, the driver is averaging about 365 and the three wood averages around 345. Uh, bad hits, bad strikes, probably looking at about uh, 320. Next up, players, we have the Old Faithful 2-iron. Now, this one is in the bag. It's been in the bag for three years. Everybody wants to know what 2-iron I use because they want to use it. Strixon haven't paid me a cent. I've sold more 2-irons than any other golfer known to man, even more than Strixon. I'm waiting for the check. I assume it's lost in the mail, but we shall see. Now, the interesting part for the 2-iron is anything, any course above 7,000 yards, I will use normally the 3-wood. The three wood comes in the bag because I have to hit that on um, longer par fives and uh, on the tee shots of long par fours. If it's under like 6,700 yards, I put the two iron in and take the three wood out. Um, if I want to keep both in, I'll just chuck the five iron out. Now, some players may be upset that, I don't know, I have a prop here, but the prop just doesn't cooperate. So the wages will be slashed. Alec Baldwin may be called on to set and then we're gonna have serious problems. Now, a lot of people may be wondering, okay, Matt, now you've sold out. You've got yourself a big sponsor, corporate sponsor, Chingala Cabron, but guess what? I haven't sold out, I've just bought in. This is show business, not show, give it all away. And next club that we have are my irons. Now, everybody has seen the unboxing of the three iron that I did, the real unboxing. How to unbox a club? This is a three iron Z-forged, blade from Strixon. It, I bought it to match all my other Z-Forged. I play the Z-Forged irons in everything from 3-iron down to pitching wedge. 3-iron has become the new 2-iron. Okay, so sometimes I use the 2-iron, but for most of the time, for a safe shot, I'm going to be using the 3. It has less dispersion and I can do more things with it. I can hit draws, I can hit fades, I can keep it low more than the 2-iron because the 2-iron has this big fat sole and I can hit the 3-iron off the deck the reason I got it, the three iron, is because I can hit it off the deck where I can't hit this two iron off the deck really at all unless it's a fluffy lie. So that's why I bought this. It's a serious weapon. This one has an X-Flex shaft in it because that's what they had on eBay. Cost me a damn fortune, probably half the price of the damn rest of my clubs. This is a special golf club created by Eric Chong of Impact Golf Malaysia. He's the one who fitted me for these irons. He's the one who fitted me for the driver and the shaft. Changed my whole world. I mean, now I'm shooting, I mean, I shot 59 the other day twice. I played 36 holes and I shot 59 on both rounds just because of Eric Chong from Impact Golf Malaysia. Now these are Itobori. Itobori tour with a black, a black copper finish. Now the thing you have to know about Eric Chong is that he's so good at club fitting. He's in Malaysia, he's in um, Kuala Lumpur. And what they say about Eric Chong is that once you try Chong, you never go wrong. <laughs> That's the tagline. That's the tagline. Once you go Chong, you never go wrong. Now, players, remember now, when I'm doing this, okay, you can, as you can see, there's a beautiful towel here, what a player towel as well. Because it's a channel sponsor, we need to support the sponsors to keep the channel going. Without the sponsors, we have no channel. So, 
they're running a big special at waterplayergolf.com. Currently, they give you everything for free. Everything's free in exchange for the correct amount of money. So once you click and add it to your cart and you pay the money, they send it to you for free in exchange for that money. I've never heard of anything like it before, but you might enjoy it. I enjoy it. So you give it a try. Now we're on to wedges. This is a 50 degree milled grind too. I actually stole this from B-Dog. Haven't seen B-Dog in a while. Um, so I don't know if he knows that I've taken it, but this is his 50 degree wedge. And I have it because, well, it was free. If you steal from friends, or as I like to call it, permanently borrow, it, it's, it's much sweeter when you hit the ball with it because you know you haven't paid the 100 or 100 or 200 or 250 dollars for the wedge. That's our eye roll. Okay, players, next wedge that we have is an MD Super Strong. Now, the MD Super Strong is a very cheap wedge. I actually have a 60 degree, a 56 degree, and a 52 degree, but when you steal a very expensive club from your friend, you want to get rid of the cheap one in your bag. That's kind of the rule of thumb with golf clubs. If you steal, you got to replace the cheaper one. Otherwise, what are you doing? That's not, that's not true thievery. And this one is a 56 degree. A lot of people ask me, why do I have a 50, 56, and a 58? Well, I stole the 50 degree, so it had to go in the bag. The 58 degree was made by Eric Chong. Remember, once you go Chong, you go super long. Okay? So we have especially, <laughs> so we go super strong. Remember, this is how I think about wedges. Once you steal, you go to repeal. Extra strong, once you go chong, you never go wrong. You go super strong. So this is a super strong 56 degree, very cheap wedge, probably about $30, because I bought $100 for three. Then we have the chong. This is what I've nicknamed, the 56 degree I call Cheech, and I call 58 degree chong. So it's Cheech and chong. <laughs> hey, Sorry. this is a custom made wedge from a head that uh, Eric Chong had in his workshop, and he ground it down perfectly for me, especially for bunkers, okay? So mainly, this is a bunker club. I do pitch with it, but I'm pretty horrible at pitching. So 56 degree is used for a lot more pitches between 30 and 60 yards. This is used for under 30 yards and bunkers, mainly bunkers. I haven't actually hit that many bunkers lately, but this is the club specially designed for it. This is the Water Player Pillow Fight Polo. I know you may have seen this on the British Open and you saw some famous people using it uh, from a certain well-known brand, but this is the original, okay? I've been the, the lead designer for, for about two and a half years now. So next up players, behind this beautiful putter cover. Now what a player have brought in more of these. They're coming, they're coming. Bef just before Christmas, I think, you're gonna see these beautiful blades. We, we, uh, we work together with waterplayergolf.com and we designed this one, but we also include now, we're gonna have a mallet, a spider, and the blade. We're gonna have new colors. This one, gonna have the black and red, and a blue one, similar to this blue, but these, the feathers are gonna be like a Lumo green. Quite excitable, quite excitable, I'm quite excited. Uh, I'm so excited that I would call Water Player Gear the vegan leather Viagra, okay? And this is real vegan leather. It's made from real vegans. Now in this putter that we have here, this putter cover, I've been using the Evan Roll. This is an Evan Roll Twerb. <laughs> <laughs> Players, I'm using the Evan Roll. 1.2 blade, Twer blade. Evan Roll with a gravity grip 1.0. Now this gravity grip makes a big difference. This is a beautiful putter. It's very expensive. So remember, when you have an expensive club, you can't use a cheap club in replacement. Whatever your most expensive club is in the bag, in that position, you have to use the most expensive. You can't use cheap stuff if you have a more expensive thing. This is the Evan Roll 1.2 Tour Blade, and uh, to be honest, I don't know what's wrong with it, but it's got like some rusting on the top. Evan Roll, get in touch. Uh, let me know how you're going to um, compensate me for that. And uh, this is a beautiful putter. Gravity grip really makes it feel like cheating. I don't know how it works, but it just feels like a totally different putter when you put the gravity grip on. Um, okay, players, now we get to the juicy part, okay? What's in the bag? What's in the bag? This is a Cobra bag. I bought this last year. It was the 2019 model. Why spend more on a bag 
when the next year's model is exactly the same, just different colors. So I got a big discount on this bad boy. Now in this bag, we have a, ball, a beautiful water ball. This is an old Nike golf ball. And I use this when I think I'm gonna pull my brand new golf balls into the water. In this pocket, players, what do we... Uh, we have a tee. Somebody, somebody gave me this tee. It's absolutely beautiful. I think this is from Tiski. Okay, in this, in this section here, we have the beautiful rangefinder, and um, we have a face panty. Uh, what else do we got? We, if you don't have a top flight golf ball in your golf bag, if you don't have a top flight, do you even play golf? If you don't have a top flight, do you even play golf? You can quote me on that. Inside there is absolutely nothing. Inside here, players, we have a bag of Zeus Impact golf balls. Now, these golf balls are actually not allowed in competition. They are smaller, so they go longer. Always good to keep those in the bag for when you're playing against people. You need to hit a little bit longer. Don't tell them anything. You can even black out the brand so that nobody knows, but most people don't know. Then you break out one of those silently and you hit that. I can probably get another 10, 20 yards on the drive right there. Inside this, we have uh, a toothbrush. Always nice to keep the toothbrush around. And uh, that's about all. Uh, these, I'll just put these in the bag and then pull them out. Next in the bag, players, we have the Gunmetal Water Player Divot Tool. Feather, one of the originals, but in a different color. And inside of that, we have beautiful water player ball markers. As you can see, you can go over to waterplayergolf.com, exchange the correct amount of money and they will send this to you for free after you've sent payment through. And this is a hat clip, okay? You wanna put a feather in your hat, feather in your cap, little clip, boom. Not on a bucket hat, on a cap. Next, a single prong feather divot tool. Now remember players, you have to plant feathers to grow birdies, but a lot of people don't understand. You can't plant real bird feathers on the green because you then have to remove it. A lot of people will leave it there. That's very bad etiquette. What you want to do is buy these and plant these on the green. These are the only ones allowed to be planted on the green. The best thing you can do is even leave it on the green because then you have to buy another one. Waterplayergolf.com, win-win. The Zen ball marker. Now players, the thing about the Zen ball marker is I specifically helped Waterplayer to design this. You can see the infinite detail on this bad boy. That black line is what I use to line up putts and then on the black line on the ball, I put it down on the green so it lines up with the line. So I know I'm always aligned, I hold putts. These ball markers are guaranteed, apparently, to guarantee you 18 putts per round, okay? 18 putts per round, average of one putt per green. This is a poker chip, and this is not for sale. This is just a piece of crap I have in my bag. And here we have the original and best, the silver double prong feather divot tool guaranteed three birdies around if you plant it and you have a birdie putt. Work 60% of the time, every time. Finally, players, we have, we have at waterplayergolf.com, waterplayergolf.com, we have the decision coin. We have the feather on the one side and the tube on the other. As you know, the feather is the birdie music. Do, 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 do. And on the other side is the tuba music. You know? Now, what you use this for is to help you to make decisions. You flip it, and whatever happens, feather for yes, tuba for no. Should I get a divorce? No, great, that's gonna cost me not much. Should I go for the green in two? Yes, I've got 260 yards, and my three wood goes 235 maximum. I've got to carry water 245 yards. Go for it, take the drop, easy life.